it was very difficult i didn't have any work at all mm-hmm. after mills yeah for almost a year i didn't have any work acting to ek cheez hoti hai that you have to be passionate about it but ek cheez hoti hai you have to be very thick skinned so for me just the self confidence that anurag kashyap gave me that took me a long way Hi everyone today we have a great guest with us today Saimi Kher thank you so much for joining us thank you pratiksha and thank you quint for having me over aapne bahut baar baat ki ki your parents decided that you and your sister should grow up in nashik instead of mumbai jaise bade shehar mein what was kind of the reasoning behind that so they are from mumbai but they didn't want to bring us up in a big town where you don't have space to play you don't have space to go swim in lakes and climb mountains so i've grown up where nature was very much a part of my childhood and i'm glad that happened because when i came back to college and i asked my friends and you know where do you all go swim they just say like, we don't know how to swim and for me that was just like everyone knows how to swim that's how i've grown up uh, so it just exposes you to many more different things it's not a very urban upbringing where your life is between your school and malls and uh, cinema halls and I feel is even लोगों से जो कनेक्शन होता है क्योंकि इन अ स्मॉल टाउन लाइक इवनिंग्स इफ यू नॉट आई टू डू अलॉट ऑफ बैडमिंटन कोचिंग सो आई टू गो दै बट यू ऑलवेज हैव योर फ्रेंड्स टूगेदर इन योर स्मॉल कॉलोनीज एंड योर एवरी वन इज ऑलवेज टूगेदर वैन यू कम टू अ बिग सिटी सडनली फील्स वेरी लोनली सो आई फील दैट ऑल्सो आई थिंक इज समथिंग अबाउट अ स्मॉल टाइम टाउन विच आई रियली मिस एंड बड़े शहरों में कैसे होता है यू कॉल एंड से आई यू फ्री मे आई कम वैसे होता ही नहीं था इट यूज टू जस्ट बी लाइक योर एट इच अदर्स हाउसेज सो आई थिंक दैट्स अ बिग डिफरेंस विच आई रियली मिस इट्स की मन किया तो उनके घर चले गए हाँ बिल्कुल आई वॉज रीडिंग समवेयर दैट योर मदर हैड सेड कि योर फादर मेड श्योर कि आपके और बहन का स्पोर्ट्स के तरफ काफ़ी ध्यान हो विच इज़ एविडेंट यू लव स्पोर्ट्स सो माई पेरेंट्स ट्राइड टू इनकल्केट स्पोर्ट इन बोथ मी एंड माई सिस्टर बट शी रियली डजन लाइक स्पोर्ट so i think it's also something which you like she's really good with languages mm-hmm. they tried to do that with me as well and i was just like ye nahi hoga yaar please mujhe maaf kar do so everyone picks up what i think they also really enjoy i started badminton when i was like 7 years old and i started playing tournaments under 10 like from that and i started traveling in school i used to main mumbai aati thi i used to go to nagpur delhi to travel so school was fully traveling with a uh, uh, badminton team and uh, that's how i even picked up cricket on my own actually it's a funny story because uh, ikbal the movie is one of my favorite childhood films uh, we had a boy who used to work with us whose name was ikbal and he taught me how to play cricket so it was just him saying that chalo khelte hai like that evening thing you know uh, that's how i learned how to i was i'm madly and completely crazily obsessed with cricket i'm a fan so uh, <laughs> like my house has like a hanging ball it has a cricket bat like these are my de stress things even now i completely give credit to my father and my mother for showing me that way and pushing me there but it's just something which i just completely took to as i at the time i wasn't sure if this was a house then i saw the bat now yeah. like, yeah, this is this is <laughs> this is definitely it i also know that you and your sister were managing a restaurant at some yes. point You know, so that's what I was talking about. Is the exposure was so different when you were younger? Because yes, there was school, but school also school. Ke pehle I used to be allowed late in school because I used to be training for badminton. School ke baad used to be badminton, and in between, whenever my parents worked in the restaurant, so we used to always be there. But restaurant me restaurant ka khana allowed nahi tha because my father used to say nahi ghar ka khana hai, so my mother had to cook in the restaurant for us. We were not allowed to eat outside food. but we in our summer vacations and things we used to work there like we had three restaurants my dad used to manage one mummy used to manage one and my sister and i used to manage one restaurant so just like i was 10 she was 12 and i used to be handling the kitchen with like 30 grown up men and i used to be ordering them around and saying there are a table number 12 ka khana kyun nahi gaya and ye wo like fully like a boss at like 10 and 12 properly the responsibility was asked that if we had so much sales my sister used to count the money put it in uh, and if the sales didn't match the money that was in my parents used to properly shout saying that if you are taking responsibility you'll have to be responsible so they had given us complete responsibility at what that age of 10 13 years old so even when i go back to nasik now like it's a small town right so people feel happy seeing what you're doing and like seeing you're doing films and things like that but they'll still say you know we remember you as 
the kid who used to be ordering around people in the restaurant so it is a very fond memory and some day i hope to have a restaurant of my own i'll come for sure please do if it's <laughs> if it's here i'm glad we have queen pushing my restaurant already <laughs> Yeah, because I was I I watched the show called The Bear, where it's yes. about a chef, yes. right? And the amount of stress that they it's go through. It's very <laughs> stressful, and that's something which again they said that when you are when you are doing something in the service industry, customers king. So if the customer comes and says anything to you, you have to be like with a polite face, say yes, sir, you are right. And well, a lot of that happens in the film industry as well, where you have to smile and say yes, sir, you are right to a lot of people. But that's how it is. Speaking of the film industry, आपका पहला जो एंट्री था इन टू फिल्म हाउ डिड दैट हैपन माई फर्स्ट फिल्म ऑफकोर्स वॉज मिर्जिया विच इज डिरेक्टेड बाई राकेश ओम प्रकाश मेहरा बट उसके पहले हर एक्टर की स्ट्रगल अलग है होते हैं फॉर मी इट वॉज प्रिटी मच नाइन्टी परसेंट ऑफ वॉट पीपल स्ट्रगल वेन दे कम टू मुंबई आराम नगर में जाओ लाइन्स में खड़े रह के ऑडिशन लो फिर कास्टिंग डिरेक्टर्स कहेंगे नॉट फिट एंड नॉट लेट यू कम इन आफ्टर वेटिंग इन लाइन फॉर सो लॉन्ग सो वो स्ट्रगल तो रहा 99% नाइन रिजेक्शन होता है एक्टिंग तो एक चीज़ होती है दैट यू हैव टू बी पैशनेट अबाउट इट बट एक चीज़ होती है यू हैव टू बी वेरी थिक स्किनड एंड दिस एक्चुअली आई वॉज वेरी फॉर्चुनेट बिकॉज सुषमा रेड्डी जो शी वॉज अ आर जे एंड अ मॉडल शी वॉज चैनल वी आर जे एंड वेरी द नाउन मॉडल समीरा सिस्टर so sushma was the one who said you should model you should try it out and stuff so when i was starting off she said that first thing you have to be very thick skin because people will judge you on the basis of how you look how you talk how you walk how you sit so you cannot let it affect you because they will be nasty to you and that's the truth so i was i was like oh, i can't just a college kid like am i ready for this and all so she said that's the first lesson so for me that was a very big lesson because it continues to be that is you are always judged so if you are not secure in your own uh, self then it's a very difficult place to be so for me there was that whole rejection phase which is very difficult as a 17 18 year old when you're only getting no's uh, it continues to happen now i'm 30 also but it's no no still come only but uh, you learn to deal with it better i think so mirza happened through a long 6 month auditioning process and uh, it was one of the best experiences of my life the outcome mustn't have been very successful but it was just the most exciting experience of my life but this is something that has fascinated me with the you're also a sports person right and sports may winning and losing is very black yes. and white you win yes. like if if you play better you win that's done but films ka success ka mm. metrics are very different Correct. right so how do you adjust to that kind of dissonance i'm this? still adjusting <laughs> I'm still adjusting because, like you, you know, like you said, when you play badminton, if it's eleven love, eleven love, eleven, mm. you're the winner. Mm. If you play cricket and you, uh, you two fifty to chase, you make two fifty one, you're the winner. There is no, there is no grey. It's black and white. Yeah. But with film, you sign the biggest debut film, which anyone would dream of, with the Rakesh Om Prakash Mehra, Gulzar Saab, S C L, Harshvardhan mm. Kapoor. Uh, and then it doesn't work for whatever reason it doesn't come together the audience doesn't like it at that point so it's not in your hand sometimes with all due respect there are so so like i'm not saying mirza has some classic film or anything but i'm saying there are many films which are very all right but they end up becoming super hits mm-hmm. and i don't think there's like uh, amir sir has gone and said this is we never know what makes a film successful so if mr amir khan doesn't know what makes a film successful how would a mere mortal like you know me who's getting in the industry no right so once you get that clear that you are not here for the success and the outcome then you will be fine so i was very fortunate i met two of my teachers who still i go to for any uh, adil hussain and dilip shankar are my two people i go to so i know i love being in front of camera अभी उसके बाद जो होता है वो मेरे हाथ में नहीं है यार बट आफ्टर मिर्जा वॉज इट टफ टू काइंड ऑफ गेट इन टू लाइक मोर रोल्स इट वॉज वेरी डिफिकल्ट आई डेंट हैव एनी वर्क एट ऑल आफ्टर मिर्जा फॉर ऑलमोस्ट अ यर आई डेंट हैव एनी वर्क एंड लाइक आई सेट देर इज एब्सोल्यूटली नो रिग्रेट अबाउट मिर्जा एंड इफ आई कैन टर्न द टाइम बैक आई वॉन्ट टू डू द फिल्म आई स्टिल डिफेंड आई थिंक इट्स वन ऑफ द फाइनेस्ट म्यूजिक एल्बम्स है one of my top 3 sel sel albums for sure 
every month I go and meet Gulzar Sahib. For me, that's the biggest takeaway. I'm a big fan of Gulzar Sahib. My equation with Rakesh sir, after all these years, he's like family I have in the city. My parents don't live here, so there's a lot I took out of it. I had a really good time on the film. Only later did I realize that box office success is very important. So I didn't have work for a year, and that's when I met Mr. Anurag Kashyap. I was sitting at Mami watching a film, and he looked at me and said, "Picture karegi," and that was it. And then uh, four years, he didn't do anything, so I had to chase him for four years. So he was a very, very solid um, person. I used to go to to say, "This is come my way. Should I take it? Should I not?" And he gave me a very realistic. Uh, idea of where i stand uh, so it was difficult but then i feel that like you said sport has taught me a lot so you have to chin up and kind of just keep working you know choked the film that was where i first kind of googled that oh who is this actor you know i watched that mm-hmm. now so this is a very good performance especially you and amrita shabash were thank you pratisha thank you very <laughs> but that was the first time when i googled oh who is this person yeah. right so is choked like a special project for you Choked is a very very special project. The project aside, just for a man called Anurag Kashyap, who's an institution for us, just to work with him, for him to believe in me when nobody did. So for me, just the self confidence that Anurag Kashyap gave me, that took me a long way because, like I said, he went away and then he shot Sacred Games One, Sacred Games Two, Man Marzia, Love Stories, and like five projects in between. But I, he, I knew he'll make it with me because it's that trust you have with a man. वेर यू फील लाइक नहीं यार ये बंदा झूठ नहीं बोल रहा है ये करेगा अब बोल दिया है तो फिर हाँ सो वैसे लोग बोलते हैं नहीं करते बट विथ हिम यू नो देर इज ट्रूथ विद अनुराग कश्यप यू वॉट यू सी इज वॉट यू गेट ही कैन से एनी थिंग एंड थ्रो यू ऑफ और बट दैट्स द नाइस थिंग राइट यू गेट ऑनेस्टी फ्रॉम हिम एंड आई रियली एन्जॉय ऑनेस्टी सो जस्ट द सेल्फ बिलीव ही पुट इन माई सेल्फ बिकॉज नॉट टू मेनी पीपल वो बिलीविंग इन मी आई वॉज इन बिलीविंग इन माई सेल्फ इधर मे बी एंड दैट्स वॉट ही इंस्टिल्ड इन मी एंड देन ऑफकोर्स द फिल्म द रोल वॉज नो बडी कुड हैव इमेजिन मी लाइक दैट आफ्टर अ मिर्जिया वेर इट वॉज ऑल वेरी अर्बन एंड ग्लैमर इज सडनली ही सेट एंड दैट वॉज इज ब्रीफ टू मी इज यू विल यू लुक ओल्डर यू हैव अ चाइल्ड यू हैव नो मेकअप सोच ले तू सो आई सेट इफ यू आर डिरेक्टिंग आई एम ऑन नथिंग एल्स Uh, तो उसके बाद में ब्रीद आल्सो हैपन अभिषेक बच्चन के साथ आई थिंक आई वॉच बोथ सीजन ऑफ दैट सो आल्सो अ वेरी लाइक थ्रिलर इज वन ऑफ माय फेवरेट जॉनर सो हाउ वाज द एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ दैट ऑफ ब्रीद सो यू नो इट वाज एक्चुअली मिर्जिया एंड आफ्टर मिर्जिया आई डिड अ मराठी फिल्म कॉल्ड माउली विद रितेश देशमुख बट लाइक आई सेड देन देयर वाज ब्रीद देयर वाज स्पेशल ऑप्स देयर वाज अ तेलुगु फिल्म कॉल्ड वाइल्ड डॉग विद नागार्जुना सो दिस वाज ऑल इन बिटवीन चोक्ड बट like i said is i used to go there were a lot of offers coming in but there was literally like the girl had nothing to do in it char gaane hai dance hai waise wale offer aa rahe the so i used to go to uh, ak and to anurag and he used to say that see uh, ott is going to be the big thing so breathe was literally like the second show that was made there were it was very new uh, sacred games also hadn't come out that time yeah, one when of the breathe first one came. Yeah, to, yeah. yeah so he said that this he said is your role impactful is it going to change the show so i said it's impact it's yeah. it is very integral to the show he said don't forget don't think about screen time think about impact so it was basis his advice i i did breathe it was basis his advice i did mar the marathi film mauli saying that you are he said you are maharashtrian you have to marathi audience ahe tyancha shi bol so he was saying that connect tyancha shi connect karayla pahije so it was again his like i used to go to him saying do you think this makes sense that doesn't make sense a uh, special ops was also neeraj pandey i think it's his it's that genre which he loves making and he neeraj sir is fantastic at it like mm-hmm. venus day is one of my most favorite films so is that genre which he is so very good at so he said why would you not want to do action and it's going to become bigger in the next season so it was all that with breed of course working with ab which uh, he's become my co-star i've worked with the most now because i've just done a film with him but uh, we, yes yes but it was great fun we were get, getting to play a cricketer in ghumar right i'm sure that's exciting so uh, you know my mother used to keep saying you should manifest things that you want and nowadays in instagram per manifestation is like the <laughs> thing right a big thing yeah so i actually used to be like ha ha but i didn't believe it but i think i believe in it now because this is something that i have been wanting ever since i started acting 
like i would chase every sport film that was made uh, unfortunately whatever things didn't work out but with this also balki sir actually had met me 4 years ago and he wanted to do this 4 years ago but it was not coming together so i for me this is just the best thing i could ask for because i really love being in front of camera and i really love cricket mm-hmm. so, so it's just a yeah just <laughs> merge merge of both those things is just the most exciting thing uh, it definitely has like people ask me saying okay now you're playing cricket it must be easy, must have been easier for you this has been the toughest film that i've done till date because i'm not just playing a cricketer i'm playing a cricketer with disability so i don't have an arm in the film so emotionally this film has sucked everything out of me like i had to go for a diving trip to just like come back to just normalcy because it was just living a life of somebody who's gone through a uh, such kind of a tragic accident it it's really taken a lot lot out of me it takes a toll on you yes. but yeah like a person normally to you play right handed right but you'd have to switch for the film yes. So physically भी वो टफ ही था क्योंकि लोग क्रिकेट तो मैं राइट हैंड से खेल ही लेती हूँ पर अब लेफ्ट हैंड से ऐसे थोड़ी होता है यार कि आप मतलब वायलिन बजाते हो तो आप दूसरे हाथ से भी वायलिन बजा लोगे ऐसे नहीं होता ना ट्राई कटिंग और नींबू विथ वन हैंड नहीं होता ट्राई कटिंग विथ योर अदर हैंड इट्स वेरी डिफिकल्ट सो ट्रेनिंग वाइज आई ऑब्वियसली स्पेंड अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम डूइंग थिंग्स विथ जस्ट वन हैंड एंड आई डिड ऑल दैट ट्रेनिंग बट दैट्स वन यू कैंड ऑफ रियलाइज हाउ यू टेक सो मेनी थिंग्स सो ग्रांटेड on the other side of things do you still kind of just starting starting mein jab aapko projects mil rahe the you wanted your char- characters to be impactful right ki agar is character ko film se nikal diya jaye correct then that will be an effect right so that's something that you look for when you get scripts absolutely that's yeah. something which i look for that like i said again this something that ak taught me is that even if it's small the screen time small does it have an impact on the film is something which should make a difference like it shouldn't be a character which is just forgettable you know yeah so and i was actually forgot to ask you the starting mein but both of your parents are models right they're super models in fact matlab mm-hmm. so did that kind of have an impact on you growing up that not at of... all yeah then my father used to joke that my mother was miss india i forgot which year and she, he says now she's mother india <laughs> so there was no impact whatsoever with uh, modeling and like like i said our life was extremely normal and we had a very middle class upbringing so it was never a topic of discussion like it never was it just so happened that i went to college started doing theater enjoyed it and came back to wanting to do this but there was absolutely never any that kind of influence in our upbringing at all aisa kabhi nahi tha ki yahi karna hai bilkul nahi bilkul nahi yahi karna hai matlab actually they were surprised abhi bhi wo poochte hai ki are you sure why are you acting like they still wonder why like all my school friends and college friends uh when i decided to model and act they were they actually laughed first they mm-hmm. laughed and after they laughed they said ha theek hai yaar kar le ek ek aad picture kar degi and sachin will come to see your film so my college friends thing was that you act so ek ek din kuch film karegi aur sachin picture dekhne aayenge that was the reason just both of you becoming fans of each other hopefully <laughs> that is pushing it it's really pushing it <laughs> but uh, just for him to even watch it's like it's a big deal it's a big deal but even for badminton uh, training you used to do with uh, sana nehwal no no training. i didn't do tra- i played opposite her and hmm. she smashed me so that this was junior nationals i don't think she'll remember also hmm. but uh, she smashed me like some 11 3 11 4 something like that like totally smashed me and i must have been 14 so i realized that boss isme to career mushkil hi hai because i was ranked i was ranked india 8 hmm. india 9 or something like that but uh, we not trained i've played opposite her the fact that you have been doing so many things when you were like 10 to 14 is still shocking to me so many nice sport or uh, so sport uh, you were restaurant. getting into acting restaurant nee, acting to bahut baad mein hua na teens only <laughs> Those that was 17 years. 18 huh. yeah that decade where everyone is just relaxing in college i was also relaxing only kyunki bachpan mein puchte na no 10 especially 9 10 to bade ho ke kya karna hai and also when people used to come home once like my parents used to just look at me because i was how does a 13 year old know what that person wants to do in life right mm-hmm. so i used to say uh, i want to be an architect like mm-hmm. with a straight face then next day somebody used to come i used to say i'm thinking of getting into medicine 
like i used to just make up stuff and my parents to look at me saying what is wrong with you but they are asking me so i'll keep a straight face and answer saying ha i think i'm going to be a ca so kuch bhi mai bol deti thi to different different people so i think as an actor i ended up trying to do all of it right because yeah. as an actor you can live all these lives <laughs> that's what you're doing now also yes. ek kabhi ye kabhi yeah. cricketer koi wo very smart <laughs> but okay to wrap things up i'll ask you one last thing if there was one thing that you had to tell yourself either when it was when you were managing your restaurant or when you just entered the film industry what would it be i think different times it's a different thing like the restaurant time i was a kid i was really enjoying myself with regards to the films and when i grew up a little more because 10 is really very young but when very i grew young. up when i grew up a little more there's a line that javed akhtar wrote which resonated with me with me a lot which said uh, क्यों डरे जिंदगी में क्या होगा कुछ ना हुआ तो तजुर्बा होगा सो आई फील दैट्स अ लाइन विच इज रेजोनेटेड सेइंग दैट डोंट बी फ्राइटेंड ऑफ व्हाट इज गोइंग टू बी लाइक जस्ट एंजॉय इट बिकॉज इट्स गोइंग टू बी एन एक्सपीरियंस व्हिच विल मेक यू समथिंग बेटर दैट्स वंडरफुल दैट्स एक्चुअली अ वंडरफुल नोट टू एंड दिस ऑन थैंक यू सो मच फॉर टॉकिंग टू मी टुडे इट वाज एन एब्सोल्यूट प्लेजर थैंक यू